Yo, what's up, guys? This is Foss here. Just wanted to bring you out uh, how to do a simple OCE. <coughs> First thing you're going to want to do is open up Sony Vegas, which I already have opened up, and have your clip ready. Whatever, just cut your clip. Right click on it, disable the resample, and uncheck maintain that ratio. After that, have your song ready and <coughs> that's basically it so next thing is we're gonna insert a video track put a J cross editing pack drag these uh, black bars into it so it can look pretty decent take a your pack bro Alright, <clears throat> second thing you're going to do is add a color corrector. So, let's go to. I don't use magic bullet looks because it's too much. I think it's too much. I use curves, saturation, and soft contrast. And there you can see it starts to change. So right here, <coughs> this is my brightness. You can copy those settings down. My color corrector, I have so many. Uh, burn scrapyards. So let's just play around with this one. Just make it like that. Saturation, put it on MW3, you can copy those settings as well. The soft contrast is just leave that as it is. It already has <coughs> some nice effects on it. Uh next thing, you're gonna wanna sync the song with the clip. Uh so let's try to do that right now. Which I already have done, so Yeah, mine's is already perfect, so uh I'm just gonna have to oh yeah, my my syncing is already perfect, so next thing you wanna do because in this clip we're gonna add a lot of twixter, uh you're gonna click on the video and on your keyboard, play I mean type in U or U and then just right click on the audio and delete that because what it will do it's just gonna make it, you know, so your twixter can work pretty good. And what I do most of the times um, is from right here, I'll add Twixter after the shot. So it'll be like right here. You So it's going to start from here. And I'm just going to go all the way over here so I can add some Twixter to it. Because that's way too much. I'm gonna cut it right here. And on this clip right here, the extra length where it, he's running, you're gonna leave that open so you can add some art. Real smart motion blur. And what your real smart motion blur would do makes it, it just makes it sexy. I'm done. All right there. Uh, it will take longer if you render it, so just note that. So you can see it looks better, more realistic, I say. Um, then right here we're gonna go to Twixter Pro, and I add default first. So my settings are, I'm gonna leave it on one. This is a simple OC, so it doesn't have to have all that sinking into it. So after this, after you do that, what I do to uh, it's called twitching effect on 
on After Effects, whatever it is. I use Earthquake. I have my own settings. You can take it down as well. These are my settings. But after you do that, just pan crop it because it's just gonna zoom it in. And once you pan crop it, it's gonna fix it. <coughs> and then right here, you're gonna add ours, real smart motion blur as well, except for where the shot is at. So the shot's gonna be. Right here. So let's just copy this. And paste it. And uh let's just cut it as well. And we're gonna add some toaster on this. I'm just gonna put the shake already in there. And I'm gonna add some toaster in it too. Because it's too much. I always put 1% for shots. Don't know why I like the ghosting. Vegas has a lot of ghosting in here. And just fix your pan crop. Remember that. And that's basically it. Oh, don't forget to add, to add your real smart motion, which is right here. To the clip buddy. So after that, you're just going to want to cut the audio. And from here too. And just sync it up. As you can see right there. It's pretty nice. Uh if you've seen one of my uh chill OCEs, uh chill edit, uh I, I use the same shot and I edit it the same way. So another thing you would like to do is add an overlay like a blue green overlay it's like a glowing breathing light thingy on you uh, stuff do the same thing on the clip uh, type in you and delete that delete the audio track and then you're gonna have this black screen just click on compositing mode and add uh, once you add it it's gonna look like that but what we're gonna do is we're gonna pan crop it because it'll look blurry. See? So we're gonna do it like see right there. That looks pretty nice. And uh I'll recommend to add some brightness and contrast into this too. Because it's it's like whitish. I'm just gonna add that right there, and as you can see, I just add MW2. Oh no! Right there. Put this on a, a a thousand if you want. Yeah, don't fuck with this. Um, let's just put it like that, that, and copy down these settings if you would like, and. Once you get this, also sync it in with the fading on the video, or else it'll look to me that's crappy, that's just messy. And this is how you do a quick, simple OCE with Real Smart Motion Blur and Twixter. And uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if not yet. Uh, thanks for watching. Peace.